two things my grandfather said really touched me and kind of, I guess, established that kind of heart connection. One was, um, he was talking about when he met my grandmother the first time when they were 20 on their way to China. And he said um, something like, little did I know that this was the woman with whom I would spend the next 41 years, three months, and two days. Something like that. So after she died, he figured it out. He went back and figured it out, exactly. You know, I didn't know he was a romantic, my old grandfather. Uh, that touched me, and then when she, later on in the memoir, when she was starting to go downhill physically, um, he said that Mrs. Keene was failing, no one knew better than I. And that touched me, I, and I got, I, it gave me this window into what it would be like to see this person that you love most in the world begin to go to decline, and to know it and not want to know it, and the protective feelings and the fear and the